is it going guys? I am Dr. Jones and today we're playing Firewatch. Yes. Uh, this game was on sale on Steam, so I bought it. Let's play. By the way, I'm in a different room because I'm not at home. Oh, it's raining outside. Nice. There's a hockey table right here. There is original arcade game back there and basketball hoop over there. Panic Inc. Boulder, Colorado, 1975. Sound like I'm in a bar. You see Julia. Oh. She's about your age, late 20s, laughing with well-dressed professors and grad students. From nearby, see you, Boulder. You, wait. See you. What state is CU? Who, me? What state is CU? Okay, I thought. Okay, I don't know what state CU is. Um, if you know what state CU is, put it in the comments below. It's probably. <laughs> it's like. Oh. Where was I from again? Oh well. You Hen you Henry are out drinking with your pals. You are drunk. So what's your you know, major? You you're pretty. <laughs> I like that one better. You're pretty, she says, coolly. You are you are not. You're a future hangover. What? What, you're probably confused? Someone should buy you a cheeseburger, she says. She flies down the waiter, and one week later, <gasps> okay. Wait, you're pretty, she says coolly. You are not, you're a future hangover. Okay, I, I don't know, Sh cool. <laughs> I got go. I got boyfriend. How old am I? My name's Henry. I have a friend named Henry. Picking up my backpack. Did she die? No. Something sad happened. Wait, wait. Oh. You date for over a year. She drives you absolutely nuts. It's great. You move in. You share an apartment near the school with a few, with a view of the mountains. You two drink beers out on the deck. You drink beer just about anywhere. Julia wants to get a dog. <gasps> There's a scruffy, undersized beagle. Julia's in love. She wants to bring it in, bring it with her to, bring it with her to class. There's also an intimidating but gentle. I German Shepherd. Nothing bad could happen to Julia while walking this dog. <laughs> I feel like we should pick the beagle because she wants it. What's the name? Let's get the beagle. <gasps> Bug, it's a good dog. And a week later, you've totally forgotten about the other one. Julia loves him. You love him too. 1979, you talk out on the deck. It's summer, 19, 9.30 p.m., and the heat still radi radiates off of the high desert. What do you think about kids, she asks. Kids, they're not very smart or good at much. I'm saying, if you and I have a couple of kids, that would be pretty good. In that case, we should probably get married. Yeah, I would like that, you say. These kids are gonna be screwed up enough. It's probably for the best that their parents are hitched. Yeah, you say she's absolutely right. 
By the way, it might be echoey in here. Whoa, I have fat hands. Hold on a sec. Okay, yeah, so I turned on subtitles, and as you can see, and I checked the settings. It's gonna be uh, laggy, as usual. It's not the worst, though. I could turn off shadows, but I, like, I wanna leave shadows on. So yeah, I just got on my car. Do not forget to check in, no fireworks. If you're in their country, learn to live with bears. Their trail is not recommended for inexperienced hikers. Arrow Fair Trailhead. Ooh, do I have my backpack? Yeah, I do. Right, man, I'm Mr. Fat Hands, and I have feet. Whoa, am I angry when I walk? Why do I look so angry when I walk, just like. <sighs> it's a Thursday night and Julia is four hours late. She doesn't call your worried and getting angry by the minute. She walks in after you've gone to bed. She's not quite drunk, but she's clearly been having a fun time. You fight when she gets between the sheets. You fight when she gets between. I, sh I shouldn't be mad. Why would I be mad? She's having fun. You don't touch each other all night. The next day, you feel guilty for being so angry and ask her about her evening. She says it was great. You hold on to a pity pill, a tiny pill of resentment. You make some coffee and go to work. Yeah, I don't want, why should I be angry at her? She's having fun. If she, she, she's drunk. Julia still likes to draw. She draws plants from her research. She draws all the places you go. She draws you. You pose and flex like he man. <laughs> you frolic like a Victoria's Secret model. Oh yeah. Julia was Julia was right. You were very pretty. Nice. Ooh. Yeah, good thing I kept shadows on. Cause it just looks a lot prettier with shadows. But the world details can be very low. It's the lowest it can go. Two forks. Look out, tower. Eight more miles still. Space bar to climb over obstructions. Nineteen eighty two. During the summers you and Julia enjoy walking bucket at night. There's a festival in town. It brings folks it brings in folks from faraway places. One of them tries to mug you with a knife. Bucket <gasps> Yeah, your arms get cut up but you beat the guy to a pulp. You don't feel very tough. You cry your eyes out before the cops show up. Julia asks to take a different path from that day forward. You say okay. Is the dog okay? That's all I care about. 
Plan is to have kids get waylaid by work. Julie gets offered a job at Yale. Yale is in Connecticut, 2,000 miles away. It's a great job, associate department chair. She wants to move. I mean, why can't I go live with her? Go, go. You're married. Ah, uh -uh, I'm not gonna convince her. This one. You ask her if she'll commute back and forth. You don't want to move to Connecticut. She says that'll be hard, but she'll do it if you won't move. You tell her not to pass it up if she, if it's what she wants. She agrees. She flies back to Boulder three times each summer semester. Julia is sent home from Yale <laughs> on paid leave after having an episode. She lost it on a colleague for borrowing books that were important to her research. She didn't remember she had happily loaned them to him just two days prior. She didn't have like amnesia or something. She was found crying in the stairwell. You say that maybe you guys should talk to someone about it, make macaroni, and drink wine to try to forget about it. I don't want to force it on her. I feel like she should be the one to say something. Unless it gets, it works. You watch Dallas on TV and sleep together on the couch. Nice. Uh, we, we're, we're not gonna go talk to anyone about it. What? It's her life. Journal. Pick up. <coughs> Whoa, dude. <laughs> uh, oh, Bucket's still alive. <sighs> yeah, I'm gonna have to block out that. That was some nudity. Probably. Bucket is getting older. Julia comments that it's kind of nice because he gets in less trouble around the house. A week later, she goes back to the university. Julia, Julia's afflictions get worse. She can't remember things in class. Her research is in shambles. She drives her car to the next town over for no particular reason and has to be brought home by the police. She's devastated. She's sent home on permanent medical leave. Some days you get Julia who calls you a dope and your unborn children little idiots. Other days, wait. Some days you get the Julia who calls you a dope and your unborn children little idiots. Other days you get a stranger. She pulls you into bed to make love. After five minutes, she goes into panic, believing her dad is at the door. We tell her family they are crushed and, make, and begin to make trips to, from their home in Australia to visit her. For a while, your friends come by with little things to brighten the day. She gets worse. It's like that movie, um, Fifty First Dates, I think, where the lady um, can't remember anything past this one day. <laughs> you spend your days following Julia around the house. You count the seconds between the two weekly visits from Danielle, the nurse. She, she, he suggests that Julia could live somewhere else, somewhere with 24-hour care, a home. It sits with, with you for a couple of months. She needs to go to a full-time care facility. I have to do it for the better of her. She's gonna forget about me and her parents though. That's lame. Yeah, see you guys, this is the game without shadows. It looks pretty weird. Don't 
deer. Kill it. Ah! Ah! What was that? <laughs> Just like lunged upwards before running. Her family agrees with your decision. You find a fantastic place in Boulder and move her there. You see her every day, then every other day. You go out to a bar with your old friends. It's not the same. You get the feeling that every wife tells her husband, if you ever put me in a home like Henry did, I will cut your balls off. You slowly decide not to see your old friends that much. Dang. Julia's sisters, Julia's sister Susan moves to Boulder to be close to her. She visits her every day. You go with her some of the time. Susan buys you an old typewriter and urges you to use it. If you won't see a therapist, you won't. You've already, you've always really liked Susan. What, and what kind of like? Months go by. Oh, bucket! I love dogs. Julia doesn't remember him when you tell her. Sometimes it takes her a minute to lock in on you. In the back of your mind, you believe it's because you see her less and less, and seeing her less and less makes her forget you more, you think. Summer is coming, and you see an ad in the paper for a job. You take it. Stupid Henry. Go see your wife, and she won't forget you. Ain't hey, nothing tense. Well, there's that. My back hurts. Oh, there's my tower. Enter the lookout tower. Okay. I don't want to. I'll just do what it says. I don't really care. What? Oh, space to hop over. Stop lagging. Surprise, this game is running this well for me recording. Door open. Turn on the power. Maybe it's. Yeah, the giant flashing light map. Lady? Um, uh, what? Oh. Yes. I have never. Hold left shift. Okay. wrong with you? Look, I just hiked for two days, so I don't really follow whatever it is you're doing right now. You take a stab at what's wrong with me. Fine, then can I sleep forever? Sure, buddy. Okay, now go ahead. Ooh, ooh. You're rebelling against your mom. Wrong. Sort of 
Fire Watch. Day one. Gonna load. Oh, by the way, uh, the reason my knees are up here is because it's more comfortable for me because I'm sitting on the floor. You also got one of these things because I want to, and it is good. Are you seeing me? You got a relaxing, what, 14 hours of sleep? Ooh. Yeah, Jesus. This is what, 6? 6.45. Whoops. Pine cone? Don't worry about it. That hike puts everyone out of commission for a day or two. But now that you're up, let me quickly get you acquainted with the job. There's a thing in the middle of your room with a round map on it. Do you see it? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what Wes is. Are those fucking fireworks? I need you to confirm. Do you see them? <gasps> yeah, I see them. That's not legal, right? Uh, no. It, in the entrance to this place, right it said no fireworks. Can I use it? Don't feed anyone a knuckle sandwich. Okay. Get going. You'll probably need a rope to get down the shale between you and the lake, if I remember right. There should be one in the supply box on the way. The code is one, two, three, four. It's actually that for all of them. Secure. Shut up. <coughs> Shut up. Calendar, calendar. Pick up my backpack and want my backpack. Give me my backpack, yeah. Wait, right, let's be on our way. Delilah, you're not gonna answer me. Can I say hello? Hello. Now, which way is west? So I'm facing south. Now I'm facing east. I'm the read map. Zoom in. Two forks. Look out. So what am I looking for? Cash. Three o six.
That's east. So I need to go east. Let's go on our way. Where am I going? Yes, I'm going east. Let's go this way. Okay, can't hop that. Hi, bird. Okay, where am I supposed to go? Excuse me, bush. Yeah, so I need to go north and then east, northeast. Bye, bird. Oh, hi, outhouse. Oh no, never eat soggy waffles, so I need to go west. Danger, trail close. Well, let's go this way then. You darn kid, get out of here. Wish I could run, but I can't. I was playing some Bed Wars with my friends today, and we were listening to the Attack on Titan theme song. I'm a Barbie girl song. Okay, yeah. Are you kidding me? I like this game. John C. Lake. Ooh. I am almost there. Oh, there it is. <laughs> it was right there in front of my face. Fire your watch. Fire your watch. One, two, three, four. Yay. Simple. Granola bar. People just stuff these things with old food. That's how you get bears. Where's that? I'm at the cash box. down that rope, it was right where you said. Great. So you should be set to get down to the lake. Indiana Jones. Fine tone. Drop. Copy information. What information am I copying? Okay, great. Note. Cleared my nose. Do people lose their shit doing this job? There's a note that says a guy just left his nose. It happens, yeah. You're not gonna pop your top, are you, Henry? What? I wasn't planning on it. <laughs> 
pop my top, like flash. Q read. 7786. Ron. Hey man. Hey man. Guy couldn't take it, so locked so I locked up his lookout and put some stuff in the box. Found one of those bars you like, hiking into the park, and let's get when I'm back, Dave. Where am I going? I don't know. I'm jogging. Oh, so it's happening right there. Dang, they have a lot of fireworks. What about shitty bosses gonna get me killed, Hill? Uh, that Absorka Indian? Maybe, maybe Creek? Uh, it's actually English for not in my job description. Oh my gosh, I actually named it. Nice. Like this thing? Like the obviously placed thing? Hey, I'm going the right way if I'm at the shale slide, right? Toward the fireworks? You're not lost. Those fireworks are going off to the west of you. It's down the slide and across the meadow, okay? Okay. Oh, something's gonna happen. Come on, something. No, no, no. <laughs> that scared me. That was a jump scare. And it scared me. Your mom. Snapped coming down the shale slide. Maybe. Maybe uh my butt. Okay. Okay. Bouldering is fun. I've done it. I'm staring at the big outcropping down here, but I'm not quite sure where to look for our uh, high road technician. Mm. Maybe keep heading west toward the lake. This fire's out. Oh shit, Ferret or Irish. They left half a bottle of whiskey. Decent stuff. Drunk pyromaniacs. Fucking great. Oh look, they decided to have a campfire too.
No. I'm just gonna save that for later. If you know what I mean. Bad language. I would like to retract my statement about knuckle sandwiches. Feed away. Uh, yeah, there's a uh, language in this video. What do you know? People with shitty manners drink shitty beer. What? You don't like a cold musk well line on a hot day? No, no, I do. But then again, I didn't say my manners were any good. Better than these fucking litter bugs, though, that's for sure. Found the fireworks. They didn't even try to hide them. Okay, let's be on our way. Whoa, that's a bra. A bra. I found a bra. A nudie pyromaniac. Remain professional. Please say keep for later. Aw, oh, dang, that would have been hilarious if. He'll take the bra but not panties. It's just undergarments. Oh. There's a Yes. There are two naked ladies out here. Can you handle that? <coughs> Come on. I like naked ladies, same as anyone but these, you know. <laughs> Nice, Henry. Nice. This music's sick. I found them in the lake. Skinny dipping. Yeah. Yeah. in the distance. this guy. Ow! That was not comfortable. I don't want to go that way. Let's go this way. Okay, never mind. I have to go this way. Ugh. 
Well, the music, it stopped. Hopefully that wasn't copyrighted. I saw someone up there. Can't tell me I didn't see someone up there. And it's and it's uh creepily quiet. I saw someone up there. Delilah, are you watching me? Henry, you're such a wimp. Just jump, bro. So I have a bit of a confession to make. What? Stretch my legs. <laughs> Stretch my legs. Love life? Huh? I get it. It's fine. I'll, I'll, I'll keep that sort of thing to, uh, to I had a drunk girlfriend. Wife. I mean. Am I. Oh, dang it. Thundering. Hey, I heard some thunder. Yeah, I've got eyes on a storm out to the north. Okay. That's bad, right? Because of the lightning? It just means we'll be busy. Hurry home and try not to get hit by lightning. Try not to get hit by lightning? I got hit by lightning when I was nine years old, so I'm safe. It's not going to strike twice and all that. Well, there was an old lookout named Roy Sullivan who got hit by lightning. Sound of that. Yeah, well, if it makes you feel any better, it wasn't what killed him. What killed him? A bear. Suicide. Would you believe? I found a flashlight. There's one in there? Great. Well, the sun's gonna go down soon, so if the batteries still work, you're in luck. And the bat. Oh, ow! Dude, come on. Can I have it? Well, antlers are made of bone, and horns are made of the same stuff as your fingernails. I guess this is a bone. Antler. A ranger must have found it this spring. Am I the only guy in here? That's the, s the tiniest flashlight ever. Boop, 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 boop. Can you even tell the difference? I don't know where I'm going, but I'm going there. I don't know where I'm going, but I'm going there. Ooh, ooh. Hey, power lines. That's the flashlight. Come on, man. Oh. Hey. Hey, you keep your lights on at night. I'm doing a crossword puzzle. I, I do a lot of crossword puzzles. Hi, Lila. Hi, Delilah. Oh, Delilah. Oh, Delilah. Oh, Delilah. Oh, Delilah. Oh, Delilah. Delilah. Oh, Delilah. a structure that might have been an outhouse once, I think. Whoa, uh, you don't need my permission to go to the bathroom, but, you know, use abandoned shitters at your own peril. Anything I should know about the cabin at the top of this hill? Hello? Okay, then. 
Hmm. Let's go inside. Dang. Holy crap, I think I might have just gotten rabies. Go on. I'm, I'm sniffing around an old lookout and I got attacked by a raccoon. Did he bite you? I, I don't think so. Yeah, you're probably fine. Wait, is the lookout you're in burnt to a crisp and filled with raccoons? Uh, apparently. See what you're doing. What, what do you mean? I just like to stay out of haunted places myself. Okay, go on. Out with it. You want to hear about Raccoon Carter? <laughs> yeah, I do. Nice. Okay, there's that story. Oh, there's an old guitar in here. It's burned up, but it's still intact. Okay, no more plot. Well. Let's drop this. One, two, three, four.
Hi, Delilah. Bring my guitar home with me, so just gonna keep going this way, I guess. Wait, did she say follow the power lines? I am going on my way, and I'm going on my way. Do do ba do, I go and I'm away, walking through the forest. Do ba 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 ba do 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 do. Oh, I get why this game is called Fire Watch because you watch for fires. Nice. Um. Okay. I guess this is a spawning boulder region. Wait, where am I going? Drop that. supposed to go where am I supposed to go where am I supposed to go this is where I'm supposed to go huh this is open Okay, let's go. I used to go caving with someone back in Colorado. She loved it. Might be great to explore it sometime this summer. Well, that could be fun. Obviously, be very careful. It doesn't seem that dangerous. Whoa, whoa. Oh, no! Henry! Seriously, it's completely fine in here. God damn it. <laughs> Henry, very nice. This cave is gated off. It's to stop spelunkers from dying without getting the keys from the Forest Service office first. Makes sense. Although, Debbie says she lost them like three years ago, so maybe its mysteries are locked away for good. Oh, my back did not feel great. Did you drop my guitar? Come on, it says I still have it. And I end it. Oh, look, it teleported to my hand. Nice. Yes, teleporting. There's some guy out here. Some guy? Wait, he's looking at you? Is he doing anything else? I knew I saw someone before.
Were there murders? Fun? You think running into strangers is fun? Miss Dummy? Forget your name. Delirian? What's her name? Abigail? I don't know. Yeah, I, I knew I saw someone before. Guess I was right. down here I could have climbed up here that would have been helpful to know Climb the rocks, 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 climb the rocks. That is pretty. Oh, hi, Delilah. That's her name, Delilah. Don't do that to me. Uh, well, that trail isn't closed anymore. Oh, really? Yeah. Yes. I took care of the blocked path. Uh, it was backbreaking, but you know, anything for the service. Well, thank you. Anytime. Hi, outhouse. I can take a dump wherever I want. Oh. Hi, friend. You know, I don't think there's any fictional character I hate more than Forrest Burns. Henry, as an employee of the Forest Service, that is treason. Yeah, well, he really freaked me out as a kid. He inspired me to spend the bulk of my third Here, here. He'll watch the outhouse for me. Let's go. Let's go, old buddy. What was that? What can I do for you? Here, you stay over here. I need my guitar first. So so I can play some sick tunes like this. Still with one string. Force burns, you can uh you can be, you can be uh friendly. I'm gonna call you Fur I'm gonna call you Bernie. Hey Bernie. Where's Bert? I mean, no, where's er Bernie? Wait. Um. Someone broke in. They what? They just, they wrecked the place. Threw my typewriter out the window. Motherfucker. Holy shit. Um, I'll let the Forest Service know what happened. 
No, my box. The place is trashed. Uh, my bed. My fucking sheets are gone. They stole your sheets? That's just me. Yeah, it sucks. Can't believe. Okay, I put in a call. Well, what can they do about it? Will they catch whoever did it? Hawaii Five-O. Do you have any idea who would have done this? Maybe the man that I saw. Maybe that guy I saw in the canyon, but I don't know why the fuck he'd want to mess with my stuff. Well, I'll have the rangers keep an eye out for a man hiking on his own and question him if they find him. Uh, I can't believe someone would do this. I worry about bears and fires, and that's about it. And now I've got to worry about some deranged hiker going after lookouts. Great. That's true. Grenades? <laughs> yes, because grenades are different. No! You better still have my guitar. I better still have my guitar. And Forrest Burns. Bernie! I'll call you Bert. I'm gonna lay on the ground for a second. Ugh, that feels good. Ba da da, ba da 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 Okay, I'm back. Oh, I got my typewriter back. Whiskey. Oh, I got my whiskey. Hey, wake up. I'm awake. I'm awake. Our problem. Sorry, our problem. That storm knocked out the phone line I used to talk to the service, which means we're cut off. I tried radioing out, and that's not working either. Yeah. Yeah, of course. So you're gonna want to go back there, go through it, and keep going straight to the north when you come out. Will do. Thanks, Hank. It's Henry. What? You don't like Hank? Yeah, I don't like Hank. I like Hank. Thanks, rhymes with Hank. No, Thanks, Hank. Okay. Thank. Right. Hank. It both has the ank. The ank. Want my whiskey. Want my whiskey. I want my whiskey. Yes, let's save it. It's a guy in the backyard. 
I don't know what he's doing. It'll be fine, though. Let's read some glory. Never mind, I can't. Okay, guys, well... Oh. The floating guitar. Bow to my master. The floating guitar. Maybe it's the spirit of that guy haunting the guitar. <laughs> Well, yeah, well, this has been Firewatch. Uh, this is a fun game. I'm going to play more episodes. I will be in a different setting when I play it the next time. So it's going to be less. It's going The audio is going to sound better because there's echoes in here. Um, I don't know, what else do I need to say? This game's fun, it's not free on Steam, it is on sale. By the time this video comes out, that's not gonna be on sale. I'll just upload it today. It, this video is gonna come out in maybe like two hours. But I will see you guys in the next episode. I'm gonna edit this, release it, you'll see it, bye bye.